it is 7.30am on Thursday the 16th of January 2020. This video is proudly sponsored by Oxide Hosting. With this hosting company you can never go wrong. They provide outstanding customer support and all for a low price. Their services range from website hosting to Minecraft server hosting. If you are interested in them, be sure to check out the link in the description below. Hey it's me, Dunzel3 and welcome back to another Menudox tutorial. In this tutorial we will be going over the join and leave event from within JDA. The events that we want to use are the member join and the member leave. And in the case of our listener it is on guild member join and on guild member leave. You also may come across these two other events, but these two are unrelated to the member joining a guild because on guild join and on guild leave are called when the bot joins or leaves a guild. And if we look at the documentation, it says indicates that you joined a guild. And you in this context being the logged in account, so when the logged in account joins a guild. Same with the on guild leave. But because we don't need those, we're gonna focus on the guild member join and the guild member leave event. And to keep everything simple, we're just gonna write two really simple join and leave messages. As you can see in our project discord, we have this uh, bot spam channel. And I want to use that channel as our welcome leave channel for now. But instead of copying the ID and using get text channel by ID from within JDA, we're gonna get it by name. So I haven't showed you guys how that works. So the first thing that we want to do is we want to make a list. Oh, a list. And this list will be a list of text channels. And I thought you imported. And I'm going to call this don't do this. And which is basically event.get goal.get text channels by name. And... Let's make it ignore the case of the channel for now. The name of the channel is bot spam. So what this will do, this will look in the JDA cache for a channel with bot spam and it will ignore the case of the word. So if don't do this is empty, we're just gonna return because then there are no text channels found and we don't want our code to error. Next up, we're gonna get the first text channel from the list and store it in a variable. So final text channel please don't do this at all and it's don't do this dot get the zeroth index next up you want to create a little template for our message so final string use gold specific settings instead equals string dot Format. Our format is going to be welcome, then a variable to, and then the gold name event dot get member dot get user dot as tag, and for the gold name we're gonna say event dot get gold dot get name, and finally we can say please don't do this at all. Use gold specific settings instead and cue that off. And you may be wondering some weird naming pattern in this code. And that is because you should use gold specific settings for the text channel and whether they should be enabled or not instead. Because this is just bad practice and bot lists hate this. For the leaf event we can basically copy all of this. And we can say... Oh, goodbye name and then we can just remove the gold name and there we go now our join and leave event are implemented and we can basically already see it in the bot and yes because these two pieces are duplicated code with just a little string changed you should abstract them to a method that can handle both of them the events extend generic gold member event so get gold and get member will be in that base class. Just a little bit of homework for you. So now that 
our bot is ready we can go over to my alt and hit a leave server and it says goodbye and then my alt username and tag next up i can join the server again and it says welcome my user to menudocs project of course you could change these templates to add some data but for the simplicity of this tutorial i am not going to do that if you like this tutorial make sure to like leave any suggestions that you might have for future tutorials down in the comments because this was a suggestion subscribe and hit that bell if you haven't already and i see you guys in two weeks with another tutorial bye